So, it's election time again, and many voters are still undecided. And I keep asking myself, how did we get to this point? Hmm, let's start at the very beginning. A very good place to start. In 1994, we all prayed for democracy, and the nation voted ANC, 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 and they ruled for a quarter of a century. ANC, ANC, where did the ANC go wrong? Arms, they bought arms we did not need. Deals made deals because of greed. Jobs gave jobs to family and friends. And who knows when B will end? Denied that AIDS was a disease. Refrained from fixing SOEs. Relaxed our border control and gave a prisoner medical parole. Oh, oh, oh. Changed our education to OBE. Destroyed our textile industry. Spent half a billion to buy the wrong train. Imported all the way from Spain. They promised electricity for free. And shockingly, they raised our VAT. The Busasa bribes really, really stank. Like the withdrawals from VBS and Corruption is now a national sport They spent millions on appearances in court They put their sticky fingers in every pie And milked a dairy farm bone dry Conspired with certain families State capture brought the country to its knees The looting got really out of hand they made it legal to take private land grab protests are now the norm our streets are being burned for land reform some leaders are really racketeers they hire hitmen to advance their careers poverty is growing countrywide as our rand continued down the slide they are bailing out SAA again more money for that gravy aeroplane and simple the country's a mess our economy is clinically depressed Alibaba he had 40 thieves but Latuli has an ace up their sleeves they beat many times around the block but our president is constantly in shock he vowed that corruption won't remain and that the trains won't be late again but that's just part of his campaign ah shame criminals are now more brazen and cruel we pay too much for escom and for fuel they built power stations that do not work load shedding makes the country go berserk the unemployment rate is breaking all the rules the reserve bank is the target of these fools and now it's election time again to vote for them would be insane we'll only have ourselves to blame if we vote for them again the end